Hi, I'm Joe Sadler. I'm studying a four-year maths degree course at Leeds University. While I was at WIC, I was studying maths, fair maths, physics and biology, so all mathsy, sciencey based subjects, and I thought I was pretty good at them all. Turns out there was a lot harder at college than I thought there'd be, but I was always still stronger at maths, so that really influenced my choice to do it and pick maths at university because I was a hell of a lot better at them at that than I was science ones. I wasn't as such born with you know, the ability to do well at maths. It was more I put the effort in and I sort of built the sort of intelligence as I grew up and I sort of absorbed what I, quite easily what it was that I was being taught. But then coming to university, especially the first couple of weeks, it was just such a big jump and the teachers and lecturers would just shove all this coursework at you in one go and it was just like, oh my God, I ain't got a clue what I'm doing. So you've got to really do lots of work and like, I have probably about 11, 12 hours a week in university. So all, you think obviously it's quite relaxed and you have a lot of free time, but you don't. You go home and you have maybe food and then you just get strong with the work and doing coursework and stuff. And you basically I'm up to like three, four o'clock in the morning quite a lot of the time, but it's worth it because it, you know, obviously I'm doing well in the coursework, so I'm actually handed in. I've put Joe forward for this award because his mathematical ability is really strong, it's fantastic. But he also combines that with really good problem solving skills and a commitment to just getting on with the work and putting the, putting the work in. He also provided us great, well, great opportunities for first year students last year because what he did was he ran some lunchtime sessions using his experience of the math challenge and he was a student who got as far as the Olympiad which is really prestigious and really great achievement. A big option for, from a since I was in primary school really has been like becoming a teacher just because I've, I've had the ability to like communicate with p different people of different age groups like within the maths sort of department and I've been able to like convey my, how I actually do my stuff and it's been an option and through secondary school and through like, like say doing the master class I've had experience teaching maths and it'll help if I want to go on to do a like after my four, four years of my degree I can go on to do the um, teacher training course and It'll help if I have experience. There's so much going on here, and like, I'm surprised how much different it is to Hull. And I've, 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 since I knew I wanted to come to university, I'd always wanted to leave town. Obviously, because of the fact that I'm doing maths, Hull University doesn't do maths anyways, so I had to come out of town. But I'd wanted to anyways, to, just to experience life a bit more and just, you know, living by myself. And it was interesting, like living by myself for the first couple of weeks was, was it seemed fun. You know, there was always parties and that going on, but. It's not, that's not what university is about, so 